जावा के वेरी 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 इंपॉर्टेंट इंटरप्रेशन इस वीडियो में हम कवर करने वाले हैं इट्स अ पार्ट टू फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑलरेडी अपलोड किया है जहाँ पे आपको बहुत सारे इंटरप्रेशन मैंने बताए विथ आंसर्स ये बहुत कमाल की चीज़ है इस वीडियो में भी मैं बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन कवर करूँगा विथ आंसर्स हाउ टू रिप्रेजेंट बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है बहुत सारे स्टूडेंट्स को नहीं आता आंसर्स को कम कैसे हम रिप्रेजेंट कर सकते पहला क्वेश्चन है बिना टाइम वेस्ट किए वॉट आर दी स्टेप्स इन्वॉल्व इन जे डी बी सी टू कनेक्ट विथ डेटा बेस सिंपल क्वेश्चन है बट स्टेप्स पता नहीं देखो सबसे पहले इंपॉर्टेंट पहला स्टेप्स है यू नीड टू इंस्टॉल और डाउनलोड माई स्कूल कनेक्टर जार वाई टू इंस्टॉल माई स्कूल कनेक्टर जार बिकॉज इन दिस जार वी हैव अ ड्राइवर क्लास विच इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल टू कनेक्ट आवर जार अपलिकेशन विथ डेटा बेस सो ड्राइवर क्लास बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है वो कहाँ पे है विच इज प्रेजेंट इन द माई स्कूल कनेक्टर डॉट जार फाइव इन समथिंग कॉम डॉट माई स्कूल डॉट सी जे डॉट जी डी बी सी पैकेज विच क्लास ड्राइवर क्लास वी नीड टू लोड दैट ड्राइवर क्लास आफ्टर दैट दैट इज द फर्स्ट स्टेप बायोजिंग फॉर नेम मेथड ऑफ क्लास विच क्लास द क्लास नेम इज इट्स सेल्फ क्लास ओके द फॉर नेम मेथड ऑफ क्लास इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल टू लोड द ड्राइवर क्लास डायनामिकली सेकेंड स्टेप इज वी नीड टू यूज गेट कनेक्शन मेथड ऑफ ड्राइवर मैनेजर क्लास इट्स प्रेजेंट इन जाओ Get connection method taking three arguments as a parameter. First of first of first one is URL, then second one is username, and then password. URL is something JDBC colon MySQL colon double slash local host colon three three zero six. It's a port number. If your port number is different, you can take it. Okay, and username of MySQL or any other database you are using. Like I am using MySQL, so my username my username is root, and password is also root. So you can use. For your uh, whatever cred credentials you have. After the get connection method or connection establish, होने के बाद आपको करना क्या है? Third step, call the create statement method of the connection interface. Create statement method is from connection interface. It is also part of Java dot SQL. Create statement method will return the statement. We need to store in the statement. Why to create statement? Uh, why to call the create statement? Because when we call the create statement method we will get the statement that means return type the statement so we are getting some methods very important methods if i want to insert the data we have execute update it is present in statement interface execute where query for the select operation it is also present in statement so it is very important to call the create statement if you are if you want to use query parameters just call the prepare statement of connection interface method what is the method Prepare statement. It will return prepare statement. It's also interface present in the order SQL. And after that, just use the execute update for insert update, delete execute query for select operation. Khatam. That are the steps. Okay. Now next question I want to cover here, and that is very important. What is functional interface in Java, and can we create our own functional interface? And third one is. Can you tell me some predefined functional interface in Java? Very simple. See, what is functional interface? Functional interface is a simple interface. Like we know interface, right? Interface having all methods abstract till Java. It after that we have something private, static, and default methods. Okay, it's called interface. So functional interface is also interface, but it having only single abstract method. Interface which have only single abstract method is called functional interface. So what about static, default, and private methods? Yeah, it can be anything. Inside functional interface, there are number of static, private, and default method. But uh, only one condition: there should be one which method, which method abstract method. Only one. That is S A M S A M single abstract method is called functional interface. Okay. And if you want to uh, avoid to add another abstract method in your functional interface, just put. Add the right functional interface annotation on top of the your interface. That's it. Functional interface annotation add करना पड़ता है. अगर कोई दूसरा बंदा आ गया और add करने लगा तो उसको भाई बोला जाएगा कि ये functional interface है. एक ही abstract method हो सकती है. That's it. Now, can we create our own functional interface? Definitely, we can create our own functional interface. Simple interface बनाओ. एक abstract method ले लो. खत्म. That's the functional interface. हमारा खुद का बन सकता है. Predefined functional interface कौन कौन से? There are lots of predefined functional interfaces. For example, we have something runnable, only run method, abstract, right? Multi-threading we have used. Then consumer we have, predicate we have, supplier, 
and function these are the some important functional interface in java okay which are used to implement functional programming in java by using lambda expression we can implement all the functional interface method that is single abstract method we can implement now okay, what is lambda expression lambda expression is is a java feature which is used to implement functional programming in java the syntax of lambda is something arrow bracket there is nothing method name nothing return type nothing kuch kuch bhi nahi only use the arrow syntax to implement the lambda expression our question uh, uh, next question mujhe cover karna hai that is also very important and that is something called uh, what is class and object dekho ye bahut simple question lagta hai but uh, answer dene ke liye student something like uh, sir class having variables methods yes agree that but ek acche se agar batayenge hum to interviewer will be say like yes you know that so what is class and object see uh, or what is the difference in between class and object you can say like class is just we can say it's not a real world entity no class is does not exist in the real world like we are we are creating student class but there is no student in real world you agree or not there is student no there is a ram there is a lakshman there is a akash something that that the object of the student is available but student itself is not available suppose there is an animal there is an animal can we say hey animal please come here no no one is come because animal is does not exist in the real world but there is a cat there is a dog there is a tiger the objects of that animal is present that means class real world mein hota hi nahi hai object is present in real world so class does not take the memory for execution but object will definitely take the memory for execution we can create class by using class keyword and we can create object by using new keyword there are many others way also to create the objects but common way is new keyword okay class name reference variable equal to new class name then uh, inside class we can take variables methods constructors and blocks and uh, object having states and behaviors what is meant by state 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 means variables behavior means methods hote by object ko okay object can hold that's it itna simple batana hai aur last ek cover karte hain then we will stop okay third part please ek like and ek comment aapka banna chahiye aur simple next part itna hi likhna hai bhai पिछले वीडियो को आपने बहुत सपोर्ट किया दैट्स वाई दिस वीडियो इज कमिंग एक लाइक आपका हर एक का चाहिए ताकि मैं थर्ड पार्ट भी बनाऊ ओके नाउ एक बहुत सिंपल इंटर क्वेश्चन है लाइक uh, like, uh, uh, कौन सा रे बाबा <laughs> इसके ऊपर हम कवर करते हैं लाइक एफ्ट्रैक्ट क्लास इंटरफेस में डिफरेंस चलेगा ना चलेगा ये ये भी क्वेश्चन बहुत बार पूछा जाता है वट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन एफ्ट्रैक्ट क्लास इंटरफेस सी वेरी सिंपल बेसिकली एफ्ट्रैक्ट क्लास एंड इंटरफेस वी आर यूजिंग फॉर to achieve the abstraction there is some differences inside abstract class we can take concrete methods that means abstract methods also and uh, static methods instance methods we can take but inside interface we can take only abstract method till java it after the java it we can take static but not instance instance is not available abstract class having constructor but interface does not have constructor right then we can say uh after a class can extend can extend another class but uh, interface or interface interface can extend interspace itself okay wo oh, interface ko extend karta hai after a class class ko bhi extend kar sakta hai okay now aur kuch difference bol sakte hain bhai object ko dono ka bhi nahi banta then agar main aur difference ki baat karu hmm ha interface can have all the members by default public but abstract class can have any any type of uh, member like public protected private default any type but interface ke andar guys suppose public hota hai if you are creating method void m1 it's also public if you are creating variable like integer h it's also public okay by default interface contain variable like public static final but in abstract class any type of variable we can take okay so these type of differences we need to say we need to implement interface we need to extend the abstract class to implement the abstract method ye bhi bata sakte ho okay and then by using abstract class we can achieve 0 to 100 percent abstraction pura bhi ho sakta hai 0 percent bhi ho sakta hai kuch bhi abstract method mat lo kuch bhi abstraction nahi milega but by using interface we can achieve 100 percent abstraction that's also difference okay
और भी डिफरेंसेस आपको पता है कमेंट कर लेना भाई जितनी याद आ गई उतनी मैंने बताया एंड आई थिंक सब कुछ भी बताया सारे ही बताया कुछ बचा हो आप कवर कर सकते हो प्लीज़ कमेंट नेक्स्ट पार्ट एंड लाइक दिस वीडियो फॉर मोर यूजफुल कॉन्टेंट थैंक यू सो मच